this is just going to be a quick follow-up video to my previous video where I talked about uh, how I want to use Philips Warm Glow LEDs with this fan. Uh, just showing a little bit what I mean when I say afterglow. Uh, the lights are turned off at the control right now. This is just because the board uses solid state circuitry rather than mechanical contacts to turn the lights on and off. Uh, but the bulbs actually work extraordinarily well outside of the afterglow. I'll, that's full brightness. I'll turn them on at minimum brightness. They have a good dimming range, especially with the warm glow effect. You can see the light gets brighter, it gets whiter as you dim them up. These are my absolute favorite light bulb for dimming. I wish that I could recommend these and I for IntelliTouch and to be completely honest, I would use them in like a dining room or even a living room, but I wouldn't use them in a light sensitive area like a bedroom. Funny enough, the warm glow actually didn't work with Superfan. Like they wouldn't light at all in the Superfan. But I think what Philips needs to do, they need to fine tune their driver boards in these bulbs so that they're less sensitive to uh, trickles of current, small amounts of current so that these bulbs can shut completely off when used with older solid state lighting controls such as IntelliTouch.